Do any of you record our videos from Elgato? Oh, okay. I've started doing it from the last like five streams I've done it, but I, don't, I didn't know if that was like the most effective, but it probably is best quality. I'll start it a little, little bit early since it's an interactive game. I wanted to give people a chance to get in here so that we can participate. Feel free to say hello and catch up, talk, shoot the shit. Um, you know. We don't have uh, the room code. Not yet. It's not going to generate the room code until you select the game and start it up. Okay, cool. Start it up. So I need to get move on up. Move on. Up. changing the dang game from Overwatch. Overwatch. As usual, you know, regular. weird I guess it would have to I would have to do it to the individual game that we're playing which I guess that makes sense okay fine whatever yo what's up double R welcome to the stream and thank you for stopping by man I appreciate it And I'm doing all this because I dead ass want to start on time. <laughs> yeah. I mean, yeah. Everybody got quiet. Connect with Switch. The room code will be generated when the game is selected. I have not selected the game yet. I know which game we're going to play first, but I'm giving people a chance to get in. Once it's 7 o'clock, not 7 o'clock, 10 o'clock, the time that the stream was supposed to start, that's when I'll start the game and get the room code. And hello, Rexy. How are you? Welcome to the stream. 
Nice to have you. Don't get me started on that. Like I, I've been, <laughs> I've been over her in that. How y'all doing tonight? Y'all quiet in the chat. I'm about to start drinking. Matter of fact, I'm going to mute my mic real quick so I can get my drink together. Hey, Death Scythe. Welcome to the stream. How's it going, man? If you are home, feel free to join the party. Um, you can still play and chat with us. Yo, hey Alex, even though you in the stream, hello again. Black Girl Gamers, thank you so much for the host, man. I appreciate that. Ashley, thank you so much for the host. I also appreciate that. I am a sleepy guy. I messed around and fell asleep during the BGG stream, so I'm hurt. Well, you know what that means? That means we'll be up late night playing. So after we get some Jackbox TV, maybe we switch back to Overwatch and we run some, some games also. But how are y'all doing? How's the weekend going? What's the plan for the rest of the weekend? Xbox, PS4, okay. <laughs> if I survive and ignore your responsibilities, yeah, definitely don't ignore your responsibilities. That's not, that's not what we want. We don't advocate for that. Definitely handle your business, and if you have time to squeeze it in, so be it. I don't know why my Streamlabs isn't working properly. It won't let me grab my pop-up window. There you go. All you gotta do is complain about it on the stream and then it works. It's science, guys. It's science. Hey, Pimp Sugar, welcome to the channel. It's okay if you want to alert. I know sometimes it's annoying that uh, Twitch calls you out. But welcome to the stream. Hope you're having a good one. I am starting at 10 o'clock. Um, we will start with... You don't know, Jack. Yo, what's up, L? How's it going? Welcome back. It's good to see you again. Well, that's why I said if you want to lurk, it's okay. I just know that, you know, Twitch be telling. I used to have a lurk command. I need to go ahead and... Did I did I bring it back? Hold on. Let me try. Yeah, I do have a lurk command, so feel free to use it.
Ooh, that bottle pop. Yeah, what's up, Dre? How's it going? Welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good one. If you're the Dre that I'm thinking of, it's definitely been a while since I've seen you in the stream. If you're a new Dre, welcome, new Dre. You could honestly really use a drink after today. Literally a soldier dancing on the point. <laughs> I'm sorry you had a long one. I'm sorry you had a long one. <laughs> I forgot we were streaming. Check that out. Yeah. <laughs> That's a thing that I'm doing. It's okay. There's nine minutes left before I start. You're good. I could eat a whole pizza. Ooh, that sounds delicious. And the move. That sounds like the whole move right now. I'm trying to edit videos and be productive. So that's why I'm like... Yeah, she got some heat coming. I know that's right. <laughs> oh, it is the Hey Boo Dre. Hey Boo, what's up? Welcome to this stream. It definitely has been a while. And I just spoke to Fip yesterday. Look at the universe bringing everyone together. Okay, so he got me a bottle of pink Moscato, and I have a feeling that I'm going to get <laughs> very, very twisted because I usually do not drink this light stuff. The sweet stuff always gets you because you chug it like it's a shandy, but it's not a shandy. <laughs> It has been way too long. I appreciate you stopping by, man. It really does mean a lot. I don't always stream consistently, but when I do, I remember my people. <laughs> I always learn it the hard way because they're too delicious. All right, I'm, I'll, I'll go ahead and start the room now and give y'all a chance to like log in. Wait, hold on. I gotta do it too. Hold on. Let me make sure I don't get left out. <laughs> Let me pull it up on my phone first before we do that. So the site is jackbox.tv, you guys, for the room. Jackbox.tv. Ooh. We're set. Okay, Cookie. We think we have a score. Okay, so. Are these the same people who used to do You Don't Know Jack? Ah, uh, yep. Oh my god! Okay. I think I've played this before. Yeah, like a couple years ago. That's fun. Okay. So if she's so allergic to it, why isn't she dead now? Marcus, this is set. Marcus, you are 17 minutes late for your call. Marcus, this is set. Okay. <laughs> well, I guess we ready like Freddy right now, I guess. Shit. I'll start at episode one because I've never really... What's the code here? Oh, girl, that shit already filled. <laughs> this one's only four. I'm going to play... I'm going to play the other one after this that I think is only... It's more than eight. Um, a debilitating fear of microphones. So... You don't have to go alone. Come to the basement of St. Olaf's Church this Thursday at 5.30. Okay, so everybody's in. And I'm going to start. Because facing your fears. 
It's a bus. Wait, no, everybody isn't in. There's two more codes. There's two more spaces. Okay. Drop them, drop them. The, the quote is Q-A-Y-C. And ever since I was a little boy, I wanted to be a professional baseball player. Well, now I'm 36 and going nowhere fast. One more, guys. Kyle Pepper's professional baseball league. We only... This is you. It was just on the screen. This one's only for, I'll play the game that allows for more people right after. I don't want it to just be four people. It's too little. Just kidding. There will be parts and stuff. I'm going to lose all of these. I need y'all to know that in advance. You can force another player to answer immediately by hitting your screw button. If they miss it, you win extra bonus dollars. And our wrong answer of the game is brought to you by the San Francisco <laughs> Choir. They are so rude. Every Wednesday, except for bathing season. Pick the wrong answer associated with our sponsor to win a fabulous prize and big cash. So I just have like a, a like an XYB. And so normal? it begins. That's what I got too. Yeah, so far. Yeah, so far. We're all learning together. I've never been the one to host Let's it. <laughs> Bootyful. Bootyful. Let's analyze Bootyful. one of Kim Kardashian's body parts. About what percentage of Kim Kardashian's brain is just made up of water? 10%, 40%, okay. 80%, or 100%? About what percentage of Kim Kardashian's brain is just made up of water? <laughs> I'm buying these questions. What? Where are the questions? The question is what about what is the percentage of Kim Kardashian's brain is just made up of water? Players 1, 2, and 3. Are you watching the stream, Armani? Mm. Oh um, no, that's, that's time time time. Yeah. <laughs> Kardashian's yeah. brain and everybody else's right, brain, for that on, matter, is made up of about 80%. I did not know that. Oh, Good to know. Another 20% well, we is just so round and firm. We all stop. poor. Not, apparently not me. I still got... I took a hard L on that. And Monty, if you go to my Twitch, if you go to my uh, Twitter, it's my is pinned tweet right now. All right, all right, all right. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, like, so, you know how they called Matthew McConaughey's resurgence as an actor his reconnaissance? Well, his acting Matthew is McConaughey all right, is currently all right, experiencing all right, all right. a reconnaissance. Right. Then, what period of his life just ended? Oh my God! The Dark Ages, oh the McConaughey Industrial Age. The if McCona Matthew McConaughey Age, is currently McCona experiencing a reconnaissance, then what period of his life just ended? What the hell? That's an interesting way to pose that yeah. question. <laughs> No. Ah! Players one and two. All wrong, all wrong, all wrong. What? Middle Ages? The Renaissance first occurred in Italy in the late 14th century. Yeah. Nah, I feel like we were close, though. would follow the Meccana Middle Ages. How am I so broke already? This is bullshit. Renaissance sculptures also need to put on a damn shirt. Dance with me, Nah, don't try to play happy music to make me feel better. I'm sick right now. I owe imaginary money. You, Nebrow. Oh, somebody get me to beat the stream. And if you get this one right, I'll rustle up some extra moolah for you. Arrange the Sesame Street characters. Oh, come on. Most eyebrows. What? Ernie what? the Count. Ernie Bert the Count. Bert Ernie Are the you Count. Are you kidding me? Bert Ernie or Ernie the Count Bert. Bert Ernie. Yo, I. This is wild. We're gonna have to play this more, but I'll tap out for some round so other people can join in. This is ridiculous. That was quality. Players two and three. Sweet dreams. No, yo. Honestly, Ernie has no oh, eyebrows at all. Happening? Bert has one long single eyebrow, and the count has two, oh, two eyebrows. <laughs> yo, hey, Vince. Welcome to the stream. And yet, none of them have ever blinked. Yo, that's crazy. And random information, I feel like I should be able to get correctly. Like, I'm disgusted right now. It's time for Duck Duck Swan. 
Say the cast of Duck Dynasty attends a performance of Swan Lake and thinks there are real waterfowl on stage. What? In their confusion, what? which character would they most likely shoot? Oh my god. Beno, oh my Von god. Rothbart, or... Dude, I don't, I don't remember the names of the... Okay, I'm guessing. Wow. I am not intellectual enough for these questions. Like, this first round is blowing my mind. Time is now. It's like... Player two, cue the swan song. Wow. Player three, Odette is a princess who has been turned into a swan. So the Duck Dynasty crew would probably fill her full of lead. Good job, Alex. At least somebody got one right, you know? College. Yo, Akuya, I saw that too late. <laughs> I told y'all I would lose this shit. Here we have... The man in the backwards yellow hat. And it's a diss or dad. Player two. You're in last place. Yeah. So I choose you to play this diss or Yeah, I'm still gonna lose, boo. Seven things, and for each one, you tell me if it's an alleged antic. By oh my god. Just I'm gonna lose or this. Or an antic by the classic children's book. Oh my god. What? If it's Justin Bieber, press the X button. Okay. If it's Furious George. Press the B button. The rest of you should still keep your eyes open. Make your selections before player two, because if player two gets it wrong, everyone who got it right will split the winning. Wow. They really gene me, son. Peed in a mop bucket. Broke his leg falling from a fire escape. Wow. Arrested for falsely reporting a fire. At the house. Got high on ether. What? Got a bugle to an ostrich. Went to a Brazilian brothel. I you were a couple of bananas short of a. I did. I did a little song. That media takeout news be helping assist out. I think we can all agree that it's time for that little bastard to get deported. And then it's your turn. Whoa! Dang. Round one is in the books, and player four is at the head of the pack. Uh oh. And with an embarrassing. Score, I mean, we knew this. Amani, the smart one. Is worth double. And keep in mind, the wrong answer of the game is still out there waiting for you. Okay. <laughs> I also didn't answer the first few questions. Like, stun on us a little bit, girl. Go ahead. This one's called Dumber and Dumber. I can't. I cannot. So there's Dumb and Dumber, and then there was Dumb and Dumberer, and then Dumb and Dumber 2. Makes perfect sense. Now, going back a few decades, there was The Odd Couple and The Odd Couple 2. So, if another remake of The Odd Couple used the superlative adjective, oh my God. it would be called The Blank Couple. Odd, Otter, Oddest, or Otterist. Yo, heaven forgive me, like, maybe I should have done this sober so I could think critically because... Oh, I get it. I get Player it. three, not much time left. Think you smart? Because I don't... I just guess. And that's just the dumberest answer I ever heard. <laughs> Players two and four. Wow, he rude. Odd is the adjective, otter is the comparative adjective, and oddest it's, is hey. the superlative adjective. Right? Yes, I got it right. Everyone who made the original odd couple. Yes. Yo, what's up, LJ? Welcome to this stream, and thank you so much for stopping by. Okay. Question seven. Yo, why question seven shoes so popping though? Let's go. Why not try? Let it go. Yo, hey, A Monet. Welcome to the stream. Let it go. At which temperature would Olaf from the movie? Oh my god, I do not remember this number. 30 degrees Kelvin, 30 degrees Let's Fahrenheit, go, 30 go. degrees oh. Celsius, or 30 oh. degrees Rankin. He's a snowman. Oh, I don't know. <laughs> YOLO. I really don't know. Got a YOLO with the guesses. Hello. 30 degrees know. is below freezing in Fahrenheit and insanely below freezing in Kelvin and Rankin. But it's pretty balmy in Celsius, about the equivalent of 86 degrees Fahrenheit. Dang. <laughs> hey. And I know, blah, 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 uh oh! Seeker back in the game! Temporarily! 
Yo. They needed to give her some Afro puffs to make that shit authentic. Yes. That's what they needed to do. Kangaroo, Peanut, Albert Einstein, or Uranus. What? Kangaroo, Peanut, Albert Einstein, Yo. or Uranus. First spotted in 18. Okay, they're bugging. Kangaroo, Peanuts, Albert Einstein, <laughs> or Uranus. Yeah, you know, that's what I'm saying. Maybe I started drinking a little bit too early. I should have waited on this. Because <laughs> that was too trippy. Time's almost up. Player one. Sure. Albert Any Einstein was first me. spotted in 1879, the year he was born. Probably by a midwife or something, over a century after Uranus was discovered, and even longer after wow. kangaroos and peanuts. I've heard baby Einstein Dang. cried a lot because he <laughs> left behind some important equations on the uterine wall. Yo, what? Whoa. Yo, I put Uranus, so... That answer has a hole in it. <laughs> Dang, I'm back in the negative. <laughs> back in the negative. It's over for me. <laughs> this is not going how I thought it would. Wind or lose. If the Washington Redskins rebranded themselves with a non-offensive red-skinned mascot, what could they be called? The Washington Chardonnays, the Washington Malbecs, the Washington Pinot Blancs, or the Washington Rieslings? Yo. What color is the Malbec, yo? Akuya, come through with the answer because. Not much time left. What color is the Malbec, yo? Players one, three, and four. Damn. Okay. Chardonnays, Pinot Blancs, and Rieslings are all white skinned gray. <laughs> red. Tragic. To a connoisseur like myself, Malbec is very offensive. <laughs> Tragic. All light skinned drinks? Yeah. Quite a burn. That didn't work out. Yo, welcome to the channel, Disaster. Yo, what's up, Z? Welcome. Thank you for hanging out. I appreciate it. I want to lick and roll. Hey. If Kiss singer Gene Simmons' tongue grew to the average length of an adult Yo, please turn me down a little bit. Stick it when he kissed her. About five inches deep, about ten inches deep, about twenty inches deep, or about thirty inches deep. Okay, I feel very uncomfortable having to answer this question right now. I just want y'all to know that. That I feel some kind of way. I have to keep it safe because I don't want to think about anything other than that. I'm good. Here's what you meant to pick. Excuse me? Giraffe's tongue is on average about 18 to 20 inches long. Okay. That's about how deep into a woman's mouth a giraffe tongued Gene Simmons. Okay, but in what instance in life will I need to know the length of a giraffe's tongue? That's all I'm asking. I'm back into negative 3K. Like, I'm broke. I'm broke, nigga. I'm broke. <laughs> Step right up to the Ah, I see you don't need me for anything. It's all yours. Your house is made of what? What materials are their houses made from? What? Okay. What is about to happen? What? What? Oh shit, I, I didn't mean to do that. No! I got too trigger happy. What happened? I picked the wrong answer. Yo, they getting really insistent about the answers. <laughs> Y'all not going. <laughs> Yo, did they put Adobe? Like, uh -oh. the Pueblo, Pueblo peoples? Buffalo hides. Yo, Love. Adobe? Like, sticks. Cheese. Cards. I don't know. <laughs> I really don't know though. Who's you? Oh. Oh. Bread?
What? Tofu? That doesn't even make sense! <laughs> Mike, yo. Damn it! Cards was right after! Why didn't I wait? I thought that was the last one, yo. Yo, A Monet, at the start of every game, um, there's a room code. You have to go to jackbox.tv and put in the room code. Yo, A Monet. Yo! Seeker pulled it through in the clutch. You know what I mean? I would inflate Yo, somebody doesn't have to. Look at you, Seeker. Absolutely no problem. Yes. Simple cake that reads. Yes. Okay, that was a good first round. Hey, buddy, are you watching the stream? Yeah. Uh, can't believe I came back and won that. Yeah. Seeker for the win. Uh, the owner of DIY Spaghetti and Party. The, uh, the DIY stands for do it page. yourself. Yeah. I mean it. Yeah, so hold on. Let me just do this now before I start the next one. You're waiting your own table. You're cooking your own meal. Okay, so for the folks that played this round, if you don't mind allowing um, other folks a chance for this upcoming round, and then I'm going to switch to the lying game, which um, has, it has like, I think up to like eight people, right? Yo, L, thank you so much for the host. Oh, I'm so glad you Wait, just put us back in. Yeah, it put us back in. Hold on. Yo, L, thank you so much for the host. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Okay, we're on. Okay, so this is a multiplayer. This is a code. So for the other three folks that aren't me, if you don't mind um, giving everyone else a chance this round, and then we'll play the one that. Um, also, a chance to rotate in. All right, guys. Go ahead, the room code is B I M X. Alright, guys. Go ahead, the room code. Yo, who is Batman? Okay. I am Batman. I am Cookie Masterson, and I shaved my nipples for this, so let's hurry before it grows back. Like, we need to get moving now. Four players. Don't people ever sit around and play cards anymore? There's your hardware. If you think another player is clueless, screw them and make them answer immediately. If they miss it, you win. Yeah, that's one thing we haven't done. I'm thankful, because my friend used to do that to me all the time and take all my damn points. Flavored eye drops. Why let your mouth have all the fun? Next round, ladies, you'll get in. Try to choose the wrong answer brought to you by our sponsor to get prizes and cash. Uh, All right, here we go. <laughs> to get things rolling, eat, pray, die. Wow, <laughs> my kind of category. Julia Roberts' characters would Jack the Ripper have been most likely to? Oh, wow. Okay. Rockovich, Vivian Ward, wow. Tess Ocean, or Liz Gilbert. <laughs> I'm not putting my, nothing called flavored eye drops on my eyeballs. Yeah, I don't think that's a good idea for anyone ever. <laughs> Players three and four. Player one. Vivian Ward is the name of the prostitute Julia Roberts plays in Pretty Woman, and almost all of serial killers. Yo, Black Mage Blake, thank you so much for the host and welcome to the stream. So probably have just loved to murder her. I can see it now. He'd open a box with his knife in it. She'd reach in and he'd playfully shut it, snapping her fingers. She'd laugh. He'd laugh. And I only remember this because one of my co-workers used to be obsessed with that movie. Alright, more Moscato time. Next. If I only had a brain trust. Suppose the Scarecrow from The Wizard of Oz faced off against the Wicked Witch of the West in a public debate. If he wanted to use a strong... What? What are these questions? What you do? Attack the Wicked Witch's character rather than the issues? Misrepresent the Wicked Witch's position on the issues? Prove the Wicked Witch wrong using statistical data? Or interrupt the Wicked Witch before she finishes her points? Oh, I know this one. 
I got this one wrong because I realized that after I already pressed the button. But these are some questions. Hey, remember when the scarecrow says the sum of the square roots of any two sides of an isosceles triangle is equal to the square root of the remaining side? She was actually wrong. So you guys have that in common. Wow. Scarecrow says the sum of the square roots of any two sides of an isosceles triangle is equal to the square root of the remaining side. Yeah, he was actually wrong. So you guys have that in common. The way he be dragging before he tells us we're wrong, yo. Even purposefully misrepresents an opponent's position in order to strike it down. Is what's still going? Here's how I would debate the wicked okay, witch. It's, it's Ladies and gentlemen, one seconds. of the two candidates oh, no. here tonight okay. is a wicked witch. Dang. Thank you, I yield the rest of my time. That's because I can't hear the game. Might need to switch to like the TV. Yeah, maybe. Coming up next, getting naughty. Because I'm trying to and watch this on my computer and I can't play on my computer right now. <laughs> Player three. Your score could use a You hand got hand this. Hand you hand got hand this, hand. yo. I'm gonna read off seven names, and for each one, you tell me if it's the name of a necktie knot or the name of a sex position recommended by women's health. What are people. these categories, yo? Press the X button. If it's a sex position, press the B button. Now the rest of you. <laughs> I can't point. even. I get it. It's either the way to tie a, a, a tie or it's a sex position from Cosmo. You gotta pick this or that. Ready? Let's go. But only Lady Raikage. A half Windsor. Albert is a six. Uh, it appears uh, your score likes right to be on bottom. Besides, you made a little bit of money. You can you can bring this around. Yeah. My usual sex position is also the way I use. I got a little money time. from that, Nami. In front of a mirror. <laughs> Put a little bit of stacks on my. <laughs> Put a little bit of stacks on my money. I'm about to lose it all right now. Watch. Every time I talk shit about how much money I have, I lose it all. Shop till everyone drops. <laughs> Say at Christmas time, every single item at your local mall sells out. What is According this to a popular mean? grim fairy tale, which of these stores has the best chance to be magically stocked overnight by hardworking elves? Foot Locker, Radio Shack, Victoria's Secret, or Lens Crafters? What? I can't even. Like, I simply cannot. Player four? What? <laughs> Why not, though? One. In the grim fairy tale, The Elves and the Cobbler, a poor shoemaker is given some much needed help by elves who appear in the middle of the oh, night. Oh, I get it. I and while the shoemaker made a nice. Yeah, I only thought shoemaker because cobblers making stuff, really, truly. I can't believe I got that one right. I think your vision's blurred. I started to clear your eyes tastefully with these. Yeah, that too. <laughs> Yo, pepperoni pizza flavored eye drops though. Got you an extra four thousand smackers. Congratulations. Uh oh, Ashley in the in the wind. <laughs> Wait, what is the, the thing? I don't know, but it just gives you hella points. <laughs> and now, <laughs> this is a troll game. It is a troll game. Wrong Between the company headquarters, game. which trip should it's be the shortest? Like, right. Ikea to Kia, <laughs> Kia to Nokia, Nokia to Ikea, you got the answer. Ikea to Nokia, and Kia headquarters are exactly the same distance apart. I don't know. I'm just randomly guessing. This is wild. Time's running out. So bad. I just made the I just made the association. Um, I am double R. Because shoe making like was the only thing that was like traditionally being made. Kia is based in South Korea. 
Wow, that was a guess. Furniture cars, if it's got Kia in the name, you know it's gonna be cheap. I'm gonna have to I mean inexpensive. Inexpensive. <laughs> that about does it for round one. And player two is in the lead. It's not it's not selecting, trolling. <laughs> Game's trolling, y'all. I'm sorry. And I want to see some screwing. I didn't hand them out for my health. <laughs> Yo, these scenes are hilarious. Here's a good one. Muscle milk was a bad choice. Say the news team from the Anchorman films decides to... Oh my goodness. <laughs> if Ron Burgundy is his team's anchor, when will he run? Before Brick, Brian, and Champ? After Brick and Brian, but before Champ? Before Brian and Champ, but after Brick? Or after Brick, Brian, and Champ? I'm guessing that too. I should know the answer of this because I ran track, but YOLO. Sucks to be you. Yep. Wrong as hell. Ow. It was begging to be picked. In a relay race, yep. the anchor usually the fastest. Y'all were right! Y'all were right! And they would probably promote the race so incessantly that by the time it actually took place, you wouldn't be that interested in seeing it anymore. So let's try. Guess who's back? <laughs> you know, I'm not an optimist, but I have to say, I feel like things have been going pretty well with the game. I feel like so Ashley's cheating. She got hacks. I don't know how she got that much money. Oh no, my old ventriloquist puppet, Billy O'Brien. She lying. She cheating. I feel like Ashley's cheating. She got hacks. I don't She's the whole creative butler, team here <laughs> not include you in this game because you're too much of a troublemaker. Troublemaker? Me? No, I just got back from traveling the world, studying all the profound teachings of Tatular World. <laughs> the hell? For instance, which Tatular religious group was founded by someone with the last name of Smith? What? Oh my god, this is a real thing? Well, I'm guessing. I can't. Like, these things don't even make sense to my life right now. Player one. And you, DNX communicated. I'll take that. <laughs> the Mormon religion was founded in the 18th century. In America. So, which was your favorite I'll religion you studied? Well, I particularly like the one who treats the Dalbrian incarnation. But wasn't his name Smith? <laughs> a beautiful coffee table. Like, oh, never mind. I'm clearly missing something with that one. But wasn't his name Smith? I love Goosebumps. I love those books too. America's 11. I'm clearly missing something. Say I wanted that to go around freeing the killer whales from every Sea World location in the world. How many separate rescue missions would I need to go on? Three rescue missions, four rescue missions, five rescue missions, or six rescue missions? Ooh. Damn. <laughs> I'm gonna lose this, but <laughs> watch your time. They are trolling with the dummy voice. They're trolling with every part of this. Player four? Did you pick this on porpoise? <laughs> I can't. <laughs> Player one. There are three Sea Worlds: one in San Diego, one in San Antonio, and one in Orlando. So you would need to go on three separate rescue missions. Oh, I guess that it's lit. Oh, sounds like a lot of travel. Intuition on point. Sometimes. Sometimes. Try this on for size. Kangaroo, peanuts, Albert Einstein, or Uranus. Here we go again, yo. Albert Einstein yo. or Uranus. I guess not. The name of Jeff Dunham's purple skinned <coughs> What the hell is going on this? Albert Einstein or Uranus. <coughs> I'm gonna guess. As usual. <laughs> I'm double R here. I don't think that's the right answer. Players one, two, and four. 
His name is Peanut. Uh oh, that guess it'd be paying off though. People who talk through ventriloquist puppets kind of creep me out. Yes, they do. Through me. Quiet, Billy. Stop trying to get me to kill people. Wow, now you're creeping me out, Nick. <laughs> yeah. May I introduce the midnight run to the bathroom? According to Henry Wadsworth Longfellow, how would Paul Revere secretly signal to you? What? To in the sea. I have to do a number one in a one. I have to do a number one in a two. I have to do a number one in a three. Or I have to do a number two in a one. I don't know. Hello. It's dead not interested in your responses. Welcome. Welcome to my tape. Dang, what? Yo, how did I lose so much? Paul Revere's I was just in the lead. British was one if by land, two if by sea. Ah. Uh, we all know a number one is a P. I get it. That makes sense, but I didn't remember that. British sooner if he hadn't stopped for a number four. But negative three K? Like that's wild. That's wild. That hurt my whole feelings. Welcome to the attack. When you see two clues that match, press your A button. Two thousand big ones if you're right. But if you're wrong, you lose two thousand. And of course, remember the clue. <laughs> remember it's the clue. Be a match that fits this clue. This plus this equals that. What new thing do these combine to make? Good luck. Boo. I'm a nerd. Nobody gets pink? That was the answer. I didn't mean to do it. No, it was the panic super from that from fucking Overwatch. I didn't mean to press it. My brunch drinks. I don't know how I keep doing that because <laughs> I really do terrible. I really do terrible in like every round, mostly. Like, I totally don't get what just happened. <laughs> the last, the jack attack, it's like you can totally win if you get a lot of jack attacks. Yeah, because they'll those like stack up. Like, but it's the panic. Sometimes you just panic and do the shit that you don't mean to. Okay, let's do Fibbage, that way. Yeah, and you lose so much if you- Yeah, like, I lost 3k off one question, like, I'm still sick about that, like... Okay, Fibbage is 2 to 8 players, so let's do that. The stream is too behind on the jack attack. Thank you for letting me know. I'm definitely going to adjust the stream delay for future streams. I definitely can't do it now because I'd have to end the stream. 
Um, you guys go ahead and um, join the new room code for the new game. So the new code is UQMF. Go ahead and join up. Whoa, 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 who started the game? Who started the game? No. Go ahead and join up. Hello, I'm your host, Cookie Mask. Yeah, we weren't when you uh when you log in, don't um don't go ready. Let me go ready. Um so new code. I O S P. Nobody else wants to join up? Where you at, a stylish Jedi? Go ahead and join in. There you go. Who else are we missing? Also, if you are one of the homies and you want to jump into the xbox live party feel free to do so just send me a message and i'll uh, get you an invite we have two more spaces i'll give you guys one minute if not i'll start it We have two more spaces. I'll give you guys one minute. If not, I'll stop. <coughs> <laughs> Who is Batman? Is that you, Rexy? I have a feeling it's Rexy. <laughs> one more. Any takers? Bop, bop. Bop, 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 bop. This music is really fun. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see. I apologize. I'm, you know, playing a game and streaming. I'm sorry I missed your message. But thank you for confirming that you were Batman. <laughs> Alright, I'm going to go ahead and start it up. I'm your host, Cookie, and I look forward to seeing the worst in each of you. We have eight players. Uh-oh, who slid in last minute? If you're starting a street gang, just FYI. Let's do this. Facts. <laughs> this is round one. You'll get 500 points for everyone you fool. And you'll get 1,000 for fighting. <coughs> Excuse me? Time to pick the category. Pick a category, I'm gonna, if it lets you, if not, it'll do it automatically at the end. Oh, that's okay, I've got it. <laughs> yeah. Okay, here's your first question. In 2004, the train corporation sold pillows in Japan that were designed to combat... Oh, some weakness. of these questions are familiar. Like blank. Type in your lies now. Yeah, sometimes it doesn't let you, but and it, but it chooses automatically anyway. So don't worry. If you can't think of anything. Ooh. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Yo, who said a fat ass though? A family of cartoon fish. Y'all really ain't shit. Wow. <gasps> So I didn't say any of these things. I'm so confused. Pick something. Let's see what everybody selected. Oh, make that money, honey. <laughs> I do know who's our fat ass. You're right. I don't know why I'm playing. Breasts? He said it's so... 
They said it's so nice too. Breasts. Not like titties. <laughs> Yeah, nothing says I'm not lonely like sleeping on a pair of disembodied legs. Which is so weird. I need to see how that like cushion actually like looks. How the pillow looks. Select a category. Oh. Um Oh, it actually okay, let me do it. Question. The Snickers candy bar was named after its creator's blank. Enter your lies now. And you guys, thank you so much for coming and hanging out. Um, this game is so fun. I really wanted to have fun and share it with you guys and it's been so fun so thank you for joining me tonight i really appreciate it okay yo the hyenas from lion king y'all are odin <laughs> I gotta give the bonus like to the hyenas from Lion King because that was just creative as shit. Like, you get that. Okay, what did everyone pick? Hey, got him. <laughs> y'all just chose it because it was hilarious. I know y'all did. Fumbles with a good lie. Hey. Hey. Yes, cause Snickers is my favorite candy bar, so that's really the only reason why I know that. <laughs> yes. Yeah. Hey. Yes, on that one. Yeah, well, sometimes you got to. All right, pick a category. Hey. You're choosing Imani if it lets you. you know, it's not hard. You know what? We'll just stick with this one. Okay, here's the I question. don't know if it's gonna let me. The staff at the Edible Canada restaurant posted a sign in their bathroom that instructed men to All right, blank. Well, I'll let some type in. Lies now. You're losing for now. You can bring it back, Double R. That's the thing about these games. It ain't over till it's over, baby. Am I supposed to see the game stream only or the questions? Yeah, you're supposed to be looking at the game stream so you can see it. Okay, which one's the truth? Yeah, you're supposed to be looking at the game stream so you can see it. <laughs> These answers are ridiculous, but this question is also ridiculous. Boom. Boom. Okay, These answers are ridiculous, but this question is also ridiculous. Got him. That was a big one. Who got me on the lie? Mm. Nice. Should have known that it was my Slytherin sister over there that got me on the lie. Ooh. How is that the ri what? Why? Why would you advise men to sit when they pee? That makes no sense. That was right. That makes no sense. Hey, 
secret fake in the leaderboards, but not for long. That makes no sense. Hey. This is room two. Which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. Select the category. It's all up to you, Fumbles. Who is Fumbles? Okay, here's the question. If I can't see the game stream without looking, the without looking at the stream, lies now. Had an embarrassing. I have no idea what to advise you on love. Because I have the luxury of like looking at it on the console and using my phone. If you can't think of something. Get your lies in, y'all. Right, what the fuck? Where's the truth? What the fuck? These are some good choices for this question. Y'all really have me stumped. These all seem very likely. These are some good choices. For I got the answer right on my first one, so I didn't get to choose a lie. Dang it. <laughs> all right, very who likely. picked what? I got the answer right on my first one. Dang it. Taking my monies. A hey, fumbles racking it up. Damn turd. Hard body. Gotti. Oh Vince, I didn't realize you were fumbles. I was like, oh snap. Good job, you guys. I did not know that. Fumbles coming from that number one spot right now. You see him? I literally guessed that, and that ended up being right. And they were like, choose a lot. Time to pick and I was category. Like, I can't. I don't have any idea. But I'm like, you probably know that. That knowledge was just latent. You just thought you didn't know, but you actually did know. Well, we... you too smart. I assume you know everything, fam. <laughs> Type in your lies now. I feel like I'm always the one that submits the first deal. <laughs> I always got a lie ready. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. I always got a lie ready. Okay, here you go. Mm. Find the truth. <laughs> Oh damn, I should have chose differently. I didn't read through all the damn answers like an idiot! <laughs> yeah. Pick something! <laughs> Alright, let's see what everybody picked. Yeah, I was like, I was just going for whatever was weird, fam. <laughs> like, uh oh, got him. Yeah, I was like, I was just going for whatever was weird, fam. Got him back, wow, the revenge. That's probably it, yeah. Luckily, it's back. just wow. a color and not a smell. And the rest of the board goes unselected. Yo, Amani in the lead. I see you climbing up. I'm double R. Oh, Amani in the lead. Oh snap. Yo, TFQ Mini. 
What's up? Do the questions change? Yes, the questions rotate. No, 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 that's okay. I've got it. Okay, here's the question. Pam Anderson wrote a book of recipes with the title... Oh, this one, I feel like I should know because I've gotten it before a while ago. Aw, thank you so much. That means so much to me, really. I appreciate you coming here, especially if you're having a good time. Aw, thank you so much. That means so much to me, really. I appreciate you coming here, especially if you're having a good time. Yo, who wrote, who wrote cock though? And who misspelled recipe? Now I know that's not it. Yo, who wrote, who wrote cock though? And who misspelled That was me. Too fast. Okay, let's take a look. <laughs> Dead ass though. But I mean, I, I believe, but I no, but believable though. That's believable. I know that's wrong, but whatever. <laughs> I know the answer now. But like, honestly, though. Honestly, like. Can we get into her new look lately? Like, did y'all see her new face? Honestly, like. That's a story for another time. Can we get into her Look lately, like, did y'all see her face? Hey, got him. The only one. <laughs> Rexy out here holding it down. Oh, that was nice. Oh, I guess and I did that. That wasn't me. Yo, that wasn't you. Oh, the other wow. was somebody else walked it wrong. <laughs> Dang. Amani's just getting further and further ahead. You see this? Welcome to the final finish. This is your final question, and it's worth triple. It's anybody's game. Here's your final finish question. Type in your lives now. All the cause of death when Indian summit who die while crossing a river on a zip line. suggestion if you can't think of anything <laughs> i just i don't even know what to say to this this is a wild question like this is a rude ass game i thought i was rude as a person but wow this game is fucking rude no who put in scalp's edges come on now like don't do that y'all ain't right for that <laughs> <laughs> Feminism? I'm dead. Alright, who picked to watch? Got him. Who <laughs> put feminism? I don't even know. We're about to find out. Yo, <laughs> queen for the win. <laughs> yes, we got that one. It's lit. Luckily, the ponytail survived. Oh, uh, yo, shady. How you gonna say the ponytail survived? Yo, this commentary is really like fucked up. <laughs> like, I can't. <laughs> Wow. Amani for the win. Yes. All right. We just start another one. B D J Z. Mm-hmm. 
<laughs> Your job here is done. <laughs> you gotta spread the word however you can. I gotta get pee real quick. I'll be right back. Oh yeah, I won't. I won't start until you're back. <laughs> Come on, there's there's what 19 of y'all in the chat. Y'all can go ahead and join up. I am I'm scared of what's gonna happen when I stand up like I'm at half of the bottle I'm about to pour another glass which means I'll be at three quarters of the bottle am I the only one drinking tonight what are y'all drinking on nothing y'all silent y'all don't care y'all don't want to talk to me fine cool fine fine okay I mean both anybody like can anybody hear me I'm back <laughs> red wine for now dope government juice I'm not even sure what that is or if that's a joke been drinking all week time to take a break I can respect that crown royale yes get that liquor Gatorade, oh man, you're holding it down safely. Appreciate that. Get those electrolytes. I'm gonna need that tomorrow. Water, y'all so healthy. You're holding it down safely. Appreciate. Nobody else want to get in? Two more spots left. Dre, you trying to play? You gotta be a good liar. You gotta be a good liar. You be out here finessing girls. I know you do. Get in here and tell some lies with us. Aburame Sama, really? Who's that? <laughs> Is that you, Rexy? Red wine is fruit salad? I agree. It's kind of like how salad isn't really food, it's an appetizer. Bop, 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 bop. All right, I'll give it one more minute and then I'll start it up. Bop, 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 bop. All right, I'll give it one more minute and then I'll start it up. <laughs> Your cheetah. Mm -hmm. Your cheetah. Yeah, that's what I'm asking. Who's Abu Rame? Yo, Vince with the names. He he got he got all the different facets of his personality in these names. I'm here for that. Yo, Vince with the names. He he got he got all the different facets of his personality in these names. I'm here for that. All right, we all set? I'm about to start it up. All right, we all set? I'm about to start it up. Welcome to the game. I'm your host, Cookie, but you can call me Cookie. Seven players. I'm getting tingly. Let's do this. But you can call me Cookie. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get 1,000 for finding the truth. Select the category. Uh oh it's all up to you, Ash. What you about to choose? Eddie Murphy. First question. Actor Eddie Murphy released a dance song in 1982 titled Boogie in Blank. Enter your lies now. Hit the like for me button if you can't think of something. Bum, 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 bum. Yeah, I am playing. I'm Cameron. <laughs> okay, here are your choices. Yeah, I am playing. I'm 
Zamunda. <laughs> yeah, I gotta choose that for the extra likes because that was worthy. Definitely worthy. <laughs> Yeah, I gotta choose okay, that. Okay, what did everyone pick? Hey, Monet starting off strong. Yes. Hey, Monet. And the rest of the board goes unselected. We and shit, we out here. That's when it helped to have been born before 1980. It does. <laughs> she knows your favorite? Yo, don't get me started. <laughs> Wrote the book. I was like, oh, anybody knows that. Like, oh, y'all some young niggas. Y'all got your life. Yeah, I had no idea what that was. <laughs> 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 Hurry up. Use a suggestion if you can't think of anything. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. Ah, <sighs> okay. This is ridiculous. <laughs> Shit, like, I'm voting for that for the extra likes because... <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. Yes, these lies, yeah. Yoga, that's a good one too. Totally believable. I almost picked that one too. Yeah. And maybe your dog can teach physics to me. And that Shikamari is your boo when you're not cheating on him with the Kakashi. Yes, yeah, same, except I would also definitely be meeting Itachi and Orochimaru for some, you know, clandestine meetings in the fucking woods, my guy. Alright, pick a category. And Orochimaru first Okay, here's the question. The New York Times was forced to issue a correction after they incorrectly identified the Nintendo characters Mario and Luigi as blank instead of plumbers. Mm. Enter your lies now. Can't think of something. Orochimaru do? Yeah, yes. Did you see that tongue though? What that tongue do, bro? And Orochimaru, like, listen, crazy dudes that have like that much darkness in them. Listen, okay. I have a thing. I'm sure it's a problem. I'm sure I should discuss this in therapy. But listen. Listen. Sure, it's a problem. Like, Orochimaru, like, Madara could get it if I'm in a really good mood. <laughs> like, Orochimaru, like... But Itachi, like, I would risk it all for Itachi. Like, I would make myself a fool in these streets for Itachi, like, any day of the week. But I'd actually marry, sh marry Shikamaru. 
Yes, we out here making money though. And that means some of these didn't get picked. Very Yes. Nice. Hey. You put lovers. <laughs> Yo, you gotta throw them off. It's it's not it's not unbelievable. Let's do it. Select a You want that extra face and chest staring at you? Yo, Vince, you never know. It might work out like that Dr. Manhattan no. shit that he pulled in Watchmen. You never know. It might be some freaky shit at first, but it might be some freaky shit you like. That's all I'm saying. I think I would like it. <laughs> Is sexual arousal caused by blank? Type in your lies now. Suggestion if you can't think of anything. <clears throat> Shikamar would try to drag his way all through my panties. Girl, listen, let's not even get started. Let's not. Okay, here you go. Find the What the fuck? Okay. I think I know this one. Pineapples? Yeah, it's definitely a pineapples conversation. That's why I stopped myself. That's definitely a girl talk type of convo. But yeah, listen. Okay, what did everyone pick? Yes. Dip set, dip set. No gender. No, that's not the right term, ladies. <laughs> what? Metrophilia is being sexually aroused by no gender. That's not the correct term. That's all I said. Over. Yo, I'm kind of in the lead, but now that I said it, now that means I'm gonna lose. Time to pick a category. I'm but now that I said it, now that means... No, 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 that's okay, I've got it. Okay, here's the question. A science student in Nepal has created an innovative solar panel that is far cheaper to make than a traditional solar panel because it's made with blank. Enter your lies now. I really, really dig like the waiting music. Hurry, the Maybe that that's the the drinks talking, but it's keeping me upbeat. Okay, here are your choices. Dude, who put teeth though? How you gonna make a solar solar panel with teeth, my guy? Let's talk about the logistics of that. Like, let's discuss. <laughs> Cause y'all are stressing me out. Let's talk about the logistics. Human skin? Yeah, human skin is OD. Alright, who picked the watch? <laughs> yeah, we're just getting people to make a solar panel. And nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Really? Wow, amazing. No way. It's either the you knew or you didn't, I guess. Wow. <laughs> Interesting. I did not know that. Select the category. Yeah, yeah, for sure. Cemetery, cemetery. Let's go with that. That looks hot. If it lets you pick Lohan, why is Lohan a category? Okay, here's the question. 
PETA has asked officials in Punxsutawney, Pennsylvania to replace Punxsutawney Phil, the Groundhog Day Groundhog, with blank. Type in your lies I can't now. Pick. Okay, which one's the- A truth? stuffed groundhog? I'm dead. Actually, sundial is a great option. I think I'm gonna go with that. Because it, it would make sense. But nothing in this game makes sense. So that's my first mistake. An animatronic groundhog, it's lit. All right, let's see what everybody picked. <laughs> I'm dying. <laughs> yeah, I chose that, but yeah, that was a good lie, yo, because that makes sense. Oh, that was one hell of a lie. A hell of a lie. Ronin Day? Lie. Excellent lie. Yeah, it's like beautiful gowns. Beautiful gowns. <laughs> How is that the truth? Like, that's the most absurd thing ever. And nobody picked the other lies up there. Wow. I feel jibbed. <laughs> Good lord. I feel that jibbed. That's wild. Final fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Peter wow. Rabbit. <laughs> okay. That's what that was mine, of course. <laughs> Name of the Rhode Island School of Design's penis-shaped hockey mascot. Enter your lies now. the truth dingling though y'all tripping <laughs> I'm dying <laughs> the dashes in between so proper got me like I, I can't I can't scroties <laughs> man I'm telling you don't sleep on scrody <laughs> Let's see what everybody selected. <laughs> no, it's without the S. This is some bullshit. I want to recount. <laughs> that was a great lie. <laughs> I'm glad someone picked Richard. No, that's the right answer. I just chose the one without with the S. I'm so sad. That was a drunk mistake. No, dingling gets mad points. Yeah, I definitely gave it a like. I had to. Yo, right at the end, she passes me though. Wow. Wow. No. Alright, what's the other what's the other ones? What's uh What's Lie Swatter? Have any of you played that? One to one hundred players? Let's see what that's about. 
Yo, what's up, Woo? How's it going? You'll get a next game, Alex? Okay. Bonjour. We're about to find out what this game is. I've never played it before. So we're gonna see if we like it. Number of players in a game. The more, the merrier. Uh, there's a, a up to 100 players, so everybody can join. It doesn't show me everyone that's logged in though, so y'all gotta tell me when y'all are ready. I don't know what's about to happen. <laughs> it doesn't show me everyone that's logged in though, so y'all gotta tell me when y'all are ready. Oh, it shows five. Five people. Yo, what's up, Woo? Welcome to the stream. I hope you're having a good night tonight. I am drinking and playing social games with the homies. Um, I don't know if you've ever played any of these games or if this game in general. But um, feel free to go to jackbox.tv, um, enter the room code, and join the shenanigans. You're in? Yeah, it says there's seven people in, so I'll give it another minute. Give everyone a chance to get in. And again, this, this is what I've never played before, so I have no idea what's going on. So forgive me if it's weird and we don't like it. We cannot play it if we don't like it after this first game. So it's 11-12. I'll give it till 11-13. But how are you guys doing in the chat? How's it going? How y'all living tonight? You have not have you have you have you played any of the Jackbox TV games like uh wow I already forgot the names of them so there's that I'm sorry I'm drinking forgive me it is pretty fun. Let me know when y'all are ready, guys. It's 11.30 now. Is everybody in? All right, then. Before we get started, don't forget... Okay, cool. Players ...can go to this website and enter this room code to join the game at any time. Let's begin. <laughs> going to see seven crazy facts pulled from these fact categories. What? The world's most expensive tea is made using panda droppings. Use your device to pick whether you think the fact is true or not. Oh, okay, I see. That's interesting. I like tea and I really do not know the answer to this. <laughs> I love tea. Okay. Starbucks owns Caribou Coffee. Um I feel like that might be true, <laughs> but I don't know. Okay. <laughs> I was incorrect. Kurt Cobain's suicide note was addressed to his childhood imaginary friend. Y'all better leave Kurt Cobain out of this before I get in my feelings. What? Because of structural damage, phones set to vibrate are not allowed in the Coliseum. What? I don't even know. These are some really good, like, trivia questions. We definitely have to play this more, you guys. I'm, I'm like, learning too much, and it's hella fun just to learn shit. Okay. 
I love weird bits of information. Mark Wahlberg has a third nipple. I can't. It's technically illegal to stay in an elevator. elevator in Switzerland. Um, I feel like I don't know. Switzerland has weird rules, man. I don't know. Hey, we'll check you out. Getting shit right. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Paul Newman invented the cup o' noodle. Oh. I'm not sure, but you know, Caucasians do be colonizing like other people's inventions, so this can go either way. Yo, thank you for the follow, TFQ Mini. Welcome to the stream. And here's where everyone stands at the end of round one. Hey. Here are your next seven fact categories. Okay. Adolf Hitler. Hold on now. Hold on now. Scientists have engineered cows to produce human breast milk. That's scary to think about. Really scary to think about. And it's scary that that's true. Utterly true. I love it. Stephen Colbert is an official sponsor of the Swedish Olympic fencing team. Um... That seems ridiculous enough to be true. Wow, that's a really late notice on that follow. <laughs> Shit, Alex. After the Hindenburg disaster, Congress passed the Bad Idea Act. Uh, that sounds like some shit Congress would do just based on the name. No shade, all shade. <laughs> I lost that one. Hitler had three testicles. What? I don't know. I don't think so. I feel like they would have talked about that more if he did. But I could be wrong. They don't talk about his meth addiction anyway. <laughs> Dang it. <laughs> The first issue of Vogue was dedicated to Cleopatra. So like, Cleopatra from Africa? Cleopatra? Cause... I'm having trouble believing that one. All white models, the gag. That was my thought. A big chunk of Canada has less gravity than the rest of the world. What? How would that make sense? <laughs> These questions are blowing my tipsy mind right now. I'm like, wait, what? That can't be possible. Oh my goodness, what? You can weigh a tenth of an ounce less in northern Canada. Wow. Mushroom skin and human flesh are 99.99% bioidentical. Um. I don't know. Here are your scores. I feel like I did worse that round than I than I thought. Well, I thought I did worse than I actually did, rather. 
For the final round, all the facts will be about one category. That category is casting. Ooh. Can you tell which facts about casting are true and which are lies? Alec Baldwin was almost cast as Forrest Gump. Uh, these I'm not going to know. <laughs> The climb, the slow climb. You got it, Alex. Okay. I got that wrong. Christopher Walken was almost cast as Han Solo. I don't see how that would work. He was old as shit. But you never know. Wow. Wow. That doesn't even make sense. Lindsay Lohan was almost cast as Katniss. Man. These questions can really go either way. They're really, really good trivia questions. This might have to be our Saturday night date night. Our late night Saturday night drunk night. Where we play this because... I'm learning too much random things. This is like Snapple Cap Facts, but better. Bond. Who the hell is French Stewart? He's that dude who was, uh, he was the weird alien dude in, uh, uh, that show, uh Third Rock from the Sun. Oh! Yes, I love Third Rock from the Sun. I just don't know his, like... Sean Connery was almost cast as Gandalf. That was a show that was way ahead of its time. I fucking love that show. John, yeah. John Lithgow is one of the most amazing actors of our generation. Like, he really fucking is. John Lithgow is amazing. He really is amazing, like... He used to live in my neighborhood. I used to see him walking his dog all the time in my Julia neighborhood. Julia Roberts was almost cast as Benjamin Button. What? She really is amazing. Sure, that's some white woman privilege shit, so I'll just vote yes. <laughs> just because of that. What? Even though that makes zero sense. Shit, so I'll just vote yes. <laughs> just because of that. Thank you. I'm glad it was a lie. <laughs> Bill Murray was almost cast as Batman. Wait, which Batman? Which time? I want to believe that's a lie, but again, these questions will go either way, man. Wow. I if only, I would never want that. Wow. That's what I was thinking. Final scores. Alright. I barely made it. Alright, what is Word Spud? Word Spud was a weird one, right? With the... Wait, hold on. How many people can do that? Only five. I'm gonna go back to... Let's do one more round of uh, Fibbage. And I'll call it a night. I'm gonna go back to... One more round. Alright, let's go, guys. Go ahead and get in the room. New code is XKWE. The Riddler, all of these names that are awesome and make me really, really love and fuck with you guys on a spiritual level because I really do love the Riddler. He's undersung, man. We need like a an unsung but for comic book characters and villains. We really do. Alright, two more slots, guys. Let's go. 
fill her up. Jon Snow. Long live the King of the North. Hey. Let's go. Welcome to the game. I'm Cookie, and I will be your Sherpa up this mountain of BS. Okay, eight players, or as I like to call it, all the freaking players the game will allow. <laughs> that ass, though. This is round one, and that means you get 500 points for everyone you fool with your made-up answer. And you'll get a thousand for finding the- I need to know another Joker class way. That'd be dope, yo. Okay, here's your first question. New Mexico State Senator Duncan Scott successfully got a bill passed in the New Mexico Senate requiring psychiatrists testifying in court to wear a blank. Now, use your device to enter a bluff that you think will fool the other players into thinking mm. it's true. If you can't think of anything in time, use the lie for me button for half the points. Do it now. Damn it, what happened to my screen? No! Damn it! I'm not in the room anymore. Flip. What happened? No, guys. Hurry, hit the live for me button if you can't think of something. Damn it, I missed that one. I pressed back by accident. No. Turn on your device by touching the answer you want. Hmm. I really want to do a Symmetra cosplay, like for this anniversary skin. Like, oh my god, I want to do it so bad. Okay, let's take a look. Remember when that happened? Um, yeah, it didn't pass. For funny outfits, unless you're the judge. No, yeah, I'm dead ass. I was so perplexed, like I was flummoxed. I had to find new words to describe how, like, completely confused I was that it even was something that somebody typed up and said out loud to someone else, much less introduce it. I read a lot of weird news, man. I have insomnia. Since 1912, South Dakota State University's homecoming week has culminated in a celebration oddly named Blank Day. Enter your lies now. Okay, here are your choices. Mm. Do, 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 do. <laughs> Regret day? That's hilarious. I can see that being very, very valid. <laughs> Okay, what did everyone pick? 
<laughs> fancy pants day. That would be a cool day though. I would love to see what people wear to fancy pants day. <laughs> it's so busy you can barely hop a train into town. Really? But what does that mean for Dakota, though? Yo, Zukulo, thank you so much for the host. Really appreciate that, man. Hope you're having a good one. Yo, Faye in the lead? Word? That's how we doing it? Select the category. Select your category, boo. Let's go. Well, we ain't waiting forever. Okay, here's the question. UC Irvine brought 6,084 students together in 2012 to break the world record for largest blank ever. Type in your lies now. Oh, uh, awesome. I'm glad you're having a good one, yo. Okay, here you go. Find the truth. I know this doesn't sound really wrong of me, but I chose the most, like, corn fed answer. <laughs> and I feel like it's going to be correct. Orangey though, at a school. Let's see what everybody selected. I mean, come on. Probably not the right. Give me your money. Thank you. Appreciate it. I needed that. You know what? I knew it. It's it's yeah, but it sounded too white American. It had to. That's the only thing it could have been. Like that's the only thing it could have been. Hey, we're moving on up to the side. <laughs> Let me stop celebrating before I lose. That's always what happens. Two, which means all point values are doubled. Exciting. Time to pick a category. Okay, double R. Let's go, baby. Okay, here's the question. All Grim Acres is a nine-hole miniature golf course oddly located in an Illinois blank. Enter your lies now. Which one's the truth? I've actually heard of this place because my friends are weird. Not unlike myself. I fit right in. I don't think I'm outside the box enough for this game. Gotta step your line game up, baby. <laughs> I was sold by Apple Care. Okay. Yeah. 
It's hard to get your ball out of the cup, though. Those holes are six feet deep. Yo, the, the commentary is kind of wild, like, as fuck. And coming from me, that's, like, crazy to say. <laughs> All right, pick a cat. Uh oh, it's Woo's turn to pick. Let's go. Hot okay, holes, here's buddy. the question. It's time for a road trip. When on a spring break trip to Dongyang, China, be sure to try their eggs cooked in blank. Hmm. Lies now. Scared about this one, like what the answer is gonna be. All right, where's the truth? Okay, you see, like how it has like different kinds of urine. Okay. I don't <laughs> I'm really like my chest just the way that I felt reading these like lies because one of them got to be the answer and either way it's messed up all right to watch yeah thank you guys appreciate it great lie there Goat saliva. That was a good lie. Yeah, I figured it had to be the most effed up thing. And it was. The leaf gluten free out of it, boo. Thank you. Didn't get picked. That's disturbing. Yeah, okay. Select a category. Young boy. Well, I guess it's only pedophilia if you are attracted to the young boy who the pee comes from. Listen, I don't know. Road trip. When in Marfa, Texas, check out the unusual RP shaped like a blank store built right in the middle of the desert. Enter your lies now. to choose all these lies too good like I'm dead <laughs> I'm dead okay um okay baby gap <laughs> but it didn't let me choose my actual answer though only the bonus likes they're cheating what the hell or am I drunk and didn't realize I did it already? <laughs> Selected. A baby gap? I'm dead. <laughs> ah, I shot you fall for that. At least I got one person. I'll take it. You're mad at yourself for knowing the answer? <laughs> It's like that is stylish, uh, right, Kage? Yeah, I, I could not even think of what the hell. Prada, wow. 
And the rest of the board goes unselected. That's what you get, Woo. You gotta focus. Fibbage. One question left for all the marbles, and everything is worth triple. Good luck. Dang. No pressure, right? Okay. Here is your final Fibbage question. Wilma Flintstone's maiden name. Type in your lies now. Okay, which one's the truth? Um... I'm mad at myself for knowing this because I'm a fan of this show. And there was actually controversy about the the real actual maiden name. <laughs> okay, let's take a look. And I want to see which one they go with. Everybody googling, you think so? Nah, not for as much as we get the shit wrong. <laughs> Can't be googling and getting it wrong. Accidentally yeah, put she's the. Only thirty thousand years away from being progressive enough to hyphenate her name to Wilma Slaghoople Flintstone, and nobody fell for some of these ingenious lies. Yo, not for nothing. I smashed y'all that round. That's a great way to go out. <laughs> Yo, this is so much fun. I really had a good time. I hope you guys had a good time. I will do these uh, for like later, more relaxed, chill streams. I know you guys are accustomed to um... <laughs> Janae's like, hey, I'm ready. And I'm like about to wrap up. Um, I'm definitely going to be streaming uh, more often. Um, I am um, prom promoting going to BlurredCon. Um, here's the info. Um, that's coming up at the end of the month. So I'll be around and I'll be able to uh, hang and chill with y'all. But I want to switch it up. I, I know it gets uh, tedious for both you and me to just stream only one and two games. So... I want to, you know, let my guard down a little bit with you guys and have some fun. So this has been great. I had an amazing time. Thank you so much. This helped boost my mood so much. So thank you for coming out. Thank you for stopping by. Thank you for participating. I love you guys. Have a good night. You had some soju? Um, we're probably going to play Overwatch just off stream. <laughs> so if you're getting on, let me know. But thank you so much, you guys. Have a good night. I really, really appreciate it. <laughs>